a village life is different from um, the life I'm living now. I was born in Kisai. I was at the age of four or five when my mother died. I never got to hear another such a thing. At that time, I was only ten or twelve years old. I was a little girl. I was a little girl. I was a little girl. Sometimes I feel like I'm not part of um, Kisai because you, you're supposed to follow where your father is from and you belong to that place. I'll just sit down and be asking, where's my father from? Without a mother or a father, um, it's a painful thing. When I was 10 or 11, Auntie Esther came to my village. We went to the house and we are trying to bring him here in Imin Kibe. We will not feel like to just throw him away because he has something that is so special. Oh, yeah. <laughs> 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 I started coming. Immediately I reached here, I saw children plenty playing here. And this place, if I come, um, I always have somebody to, to help me with my assignments, and especially Uncle Steven. He wants me to become somebody in the future. We continued struggling and struggling, so he was so dejected and he felt as if there's nothing out of life for him again. So he was just living just as if there's no hope for him in the future. The only thing I heard from them is that some guys are going to the Hope House. He told me that uh, there are some people going to the new Hope House and I want you to be among, among those going. The new Hope House is a place where there is comfort, there is love, there is joy, there is communion, there is fellowship, there is, there is oneness in the family than the old house of John. When I I went to the Hope House. I stood outside the gate and said, so this is our gate. I'll be the one to open this gate. Okay. I just I just see many differences with my feelings. I just feel like I'm on the throne. You know, I'm just on the throne. <laughs> I just feel very happy. I just see the way they accepted me like a king, you know? <laughs> Our family now is a family of nine boys and three girls. I know we have a biological family, but I cherish more of my spiritual family. They introduced our daddy and our mommy. And I said, so now I will live with a, a father and a mother Wow, let me see how it will look like. <laughs> he is the one that calls himself Nehemiah's son. That's the best identity now. I just 
I just feel like it's my father. In the village, it was very hard for me to, to have friends. But right now, I have people more than friends to me now. They are my brothers now. I think it's a very good thing to be with a large number of people. You people will be growing together with happiness. <laughs> it's a very great thing. My family now is, is not related by blood, but it's, it's a complete family. Nothing is missing.